Okay, welcome to another video, guys. Uh, today, I'm out offshore in the tinny, uh, trying to do something completely new, completely different, uh, trying to catch a triple tail. Uh, they're a weird looking fish, never caught one before, but I have seen a fair few off home, and I really want to catch one off home here. So today, I'm gonna to dedicate the whole day to it. Uh, just gonna go hard, try and find one in the current line. There's a current line out offshore that I saw the other day. So that's the plan. We're gonna punch it and make it to this current line and have a look for triple tails. Let's go. Okay, so I've made it out to the current line. Uh, this is what you wanna look for when looking for the triple tail. You got the blue water out there, the green inshore water here and the islands over there. And then you get these wind lanes or current lines that are full of logs and weed and debris. And uh, apparently the triple tail loves sitting in these. So I'm gonna drive along this and see if I can find one. Okay, so I've been driving and looking in this awesome current line for like two hours now. Uh, no sign of a triple tail, which is a bit disheartening. Uh, I don't know why they aren't here, they should be, but I'm just gonna keep going for a little bit longer and see if I can find one, and then I'll probably have to head in. It's, uh, the wind's starting to pick up a bit, but keep looking. All right, so after hours of driving, I finally found a log here and it's got two triple tail on it. So stoked. They look like uh, not massive ones, but uh, big enough for me. So I rig up this rod and uh, have a cast at them with the arm weighted prawn. All right. Been told uh, by Stimo that the uh, arm weighted prawn is the go. So I've been refused a fair few times by triple tail, but I've never thrown the prawn at them. Uh, really lightly weighted gulp prawn here. Just gonna twitch this past them, see how that goes. Bigger one of the two. Oh yeah, that is so awesome. So awesome. Flicked that prawn in there and he just come and nailed it. Oh, the other one's with him. The other one's staying with him. Just felt the prawn go. Jeez, is he out of here? I only got a really light line. I've only got a 10 pound leader, and I've done a whole day of jungle perch fishing with this leader. I've done a whole day of driving for this fish, so I really don't want to lose it. So, it's gonna go super, super light on him. Here he comes. Oh, it's so cool. Very, very cool. I've been wanting to catch one of these for a while. Just uh, something totally different. Something totally, totally different for me. His buddy's still down there with him. I wonder if his buddy will go back to the log. Man, they are a random looking fish. Cool looking fish though. He's changed color like three times throughout. Oh, got him, got him. There he is. The uh, mythical triple tail. <laughs> they are a cool fish. Put him in the sun there. 
Wow, look at that prawn. Corner of the corner of the jaw. That is a cool looking fish. A bit of a scar on his back, something's had a go at him. That's cool. Very cool. Wanted to catch one of these for a long time. Yo! Here we go. That is so cool. Very, very cool. Not a monster one, but uh not bad size. I'm happy with him for the first one ever. I'm quite happy with him for the first one ever. So cool. It's cool when you get a plan and then it finally works out like that. Super stoked. Okay, the other fish that was there with that fish has uh, got super skittish when I got close to the boat. It took off and I can't see it anymore. So uh, I'm going to leave that log and keep on going down the current line here a bit. But it's getting pretty windy so I might only have another K or two down this current line and then I'll have to head in. But I'll keep looking, try and get another one. to call it uh the current line has really dissipated uh there's still a few leaves and bits of weed in the water but really broken up now it doesn't have those big mats and the big trees like i was getting earlier so i'm gonna call it now the wind's picked up super stoked to get my first triple tail i'll definitely be doing more of this uh come out be a bit more prepared and do it all day hopefully the weather's a bit better but uh that was super cool that was one of the last fish on the list for me to tick off the old triple tail so bloody stoked to that and i'm stoked to get it all on footage so thanks for watching another video guys this one's only a short one but a good one cheers i'll see you on the next one